If you or anyone you know is in the process of or plans to be a first time home buyer in Rhode Island this year, then listen up. Hi there, everybody. I'm Tyler Megan here with the Fitzpatrick team out of Remax Professionals of Newport. Thanks for joining me today. Let's get right into it. Rhode Island Housing is giving away a generous grant to any and all first time home buyers who qualify to assist with the out of pocket expenses due at the time of closing, including but not limited to your mortgage down payment and your closing cost. You may be saying to yourself, Tyler, I saw this in the news. I've seen the headlines. These programs come up every couple of years. They're only for people who don't have any savings or can't afford a down payment. I probably don't even qualify. And to that I say, wrong. Things are different this time around, so hear me out. Here's what you probably already heard. $17,500 towards your mortgage down payment and closing cost. A minimum credit score of 660, and you must meet income and other requirements. Wonderful. Now, allow me to go into a little bit more detail on all that and what you probably haven't heard. The maximum annual income requirements to qualify for an individual buyer or combined household income are $112,555. Yes, buying a house on your own or with a second buyer, relative, friend, spouse, partner, whoever will be on the loan with you are the same. Now, this is your reported annual income and it's worth noting that if you have not already been pre-qualified by a mortgage expert, that what you actually make each year may very well exceed what is considered your actual calculated income. In other words, your current paycheck and the money in your bank account may actually be higher than what the lending institution would consider your individual combined qualified income. So again, if you have not been pre-qualified by a mortgage lender, do not count yourself out based on this requirement just yet. The maximum purchase price is $546,752. I don't know where the heck they came up with this figure. It wasn't me, so don't shoot the messenger. Anyway, this is above the current median sales price of all residential properties in the state of Rhode Island which means if your taste in properties exceeds this price point, it may be worth considering that it would be a wiser investment to buy your starter home at a more reasonable, affordable price, knowing it will only increase in value by roughly 20 to 25% in only a few short years. And you can then use that equity when you sell and roll it into a newer, more long-term forever home down the road. All right, I'll say the best for last. This grant not only is applicable to those who do not have the funds set aside for their down payment, but it can be combined with the money you already have set aside yourself. This is huge. In the past, first time home buyer grants were issued only to supplement the entirety of your down payment on your first time home buyer loan, AKA an FHA loan, which equates to three and a half percent of the total purchase price. Now you can use this down payment assistance and combine it with your current savings for your down payment. So whether you qualify for an FHA loan, but don't have the savings for a down payment, or you qualify for a conventional loan, but need some help to bridge the gap for some out-of-pocket expenses to pay for your down payment or adjust your closing costs, you can allocate these funds accordingly. Lastly, this grant is not only for single family homes, but it's also for owner-occupied multifamilies as well as condo purchases. It's also applicable to multiple loan types. As I mentioned, FHA buyers as well as conventional loans, it's also applicable to 203K or construction loans and even USDA loan buyers. So if you're a first time home buyer and are starting from ground zero or have already been pre-qualified and have yet to entertain factoring in this grant into your home purchase, I strongly urge you to do so. If you need any guidance from an expert realtor who specializes in first time home buyers, I know a guy. Okay, that, that guy's me. I'm talking about myself. Um, or if you need a referral for a mortgage lender, I'd be happy to link you up with one of our trusted lending partners. Disclaimer, there's a limited amount of funds available for this grant, and I don't want anyone to miss out on this amazing opportunity. All my information is below, so please don't hesitate to reach out. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to this channel.